Hello guys, good morning. Welcome to another episode of Heavy Equipment World. Today, we are coming to show how to use the monitor to check your fault code, to check your pump pressure on 220-7 Komatsu. Alright, let's go. Okay guys, now I'm in the operator's compartment. And this is it. This is the monitor. Actually, the Dash 7 is having two monitors. Yeah, the 400 PC 400 Dash 7 is having a different monitor. And as time goes on, we'll get to that point. All right. So first, you need to turn on your key. Yes, this is the monitor. Then you hold this buzzer. Yes. But first, I'll show how to view the error codes. In case you're having an error code to see the um, um, previous error, uh, error codes. So, you hold the auto deacceleration button. Ah, oh, my camera. And that is this button. And it will show you one. This is the one. Yes. The one is for the error code menu. You hit the enter button. And these are the arrow codes. And the time it appeared. Yes. There they are. Sorry. I'm coming. This is it. This is it. This is it. These are the arrow codes. So, go back. And you open there. You go to 2, 10 is for RPM, so now we'll start the machine. Uh, this is the RPM, it's for 10. This is the rear pump, 11. This is the front pump. Yes. In case you don't have a pressure gauge, you want to check your pump pressures. That's what you have to do. All right. Thank you. And I'll try to get um, Volvo and uh, Hitachi. Whenever I'm around those machines, I'll make a video so that I'll update you guys. Thank you. Subscribe and keep watching.